As we see major progress in Nintendo Switch emulation on Android, I have some news about the Daemon Switch emulator. According to the post made by its developer recently, Daemon Switch will be releasing by the end of this month. Here's a screenshot of his post. It has been taken from Daemon Emulator's Baidu page. In this post, he talks about the emulator releasing by June end, which means that it might be coming out very soon. It was estimated that Daemon Switch would be released by December 2021 but they changed their release date again. I believe that they are not a trustworthy source for the ETA of their own emulators and I don't support the Daemon emulator team at all as I suspect that they will be using Skyline emulator codes to build their Daemon Switch emulator. Because of their uh, fiasco with Daemon PS2 emulator, how they used ports of PCX2 emulator to build their Daemon PS2 emulator but they added ads and also made the emulator paid which was total fraud. But again it's still not confirmed that they will be using stolen codes for Daemon Switch emulator but they do change their release date back to back and I do believe it's because of the Skyline emulator major updates. But before its release, let me summarize everything we know about the Daemon Switch emulator till now including its minimum requirements, will it be paid, will there be a free version and many other queries. Note that all the information which I am about to tell you guys was provided by Daemon Emulator's developer on his Baidu post or on his Baidu page. If you would like to check it out, I link it in the description box below. So to summarize it, uh, I will have to start by the minimum requirements of Daemon Switch Emulator. The confirmed minimum requirements are Snapdragon 855 or above, 8GB of RAM and also Android 10 or above. They did hype the emulation community in 2020 by saying that Daemon Switch emulator will be faster than AgNS emulator as well as its performance will be worthy of comparison with the Yuzu emulator which is created for PCs. So according to them, the performance is going to be really good. But as we still don't have hands on on this emulator, nothing can be confirmed yet. Next question is, will it be paid? Then of course, it has been confirmed by the emulator's developer that it will be sold on Google Play Store officially for about 250 rupees or 5 USD. So that is the price of Daemon Switch emulator. He has said that if you have Daemon's PS2 emulator subscription, then uh, the Daemon Switch emulator will be cheaper for you, which again is... <laughs> But as I was speaking about will it be paid, it will not be free either so there will be no free version like we had with the Daemon PS2 emulator uh, in which there were a lot of ads so I don't think it will be possible the Daemon Switch emulator's developer has not confirmed anything like that yet. Now one thing I would like to say about this emulator is most probably if it releases in June and then I'll be covering it out we'll see if it is using stolen codes and we'll also check its performance compared to again a simulator. As we all know, again, a simulator is even more scam than the Daemon uh, emulator. That can be only proved after we see the Daemon Switch emulator. And if it is legit, if it is really good, then I'll surely cover it in my upcoming videos once the emulator has been released. So be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on all notifications if you guys want to stay up to date with all the latest emulation news. But anyways, that's it for today's video. Goodbye.